the good people over at Vont sent me a two pack of the Spark LED headlamp. So that's good news for one of you guys. Stick around. Hey, hey guys, welcome back to Arabin Outdoors. Hey, I'm Arabin, but you knew that, didn't you? As I mentioned, the people over at Vont, a great company that started back in 2014. From what I understand, a group of friends got together and said, hey, we need to create a better bicycle light. And that's what they did. Now, six years later, they're making flashlights, lanterns, headlamps, indoor lights, and a number of different products. They were nice enough to send me a two-pack of the headlamp that they call the Spark. Now, the good thing about this headlamp, this is a two-pack that right now, as of today's date, July 21st, 2020, you can get these on Amazon for the low price of $13.99. Two for $13.99. That's right. Two headlamps for $13.99. And... If you'll look in the description section down below, they've given me an authorization code for you to receive 10% off of any of their products. When you go to check out, put in that promo code. It's in the description section, but I'll also put it right here. When you do that, you receive 10% off of any of their products. Let's talk about the headlamp, shall we? I've had the pleasure of testing it out for two days now. I have to admit, prior to this, I was not a headlamp person. I've always been a flashlight, handheld flashlight person. And Vaught makes those, by the way. But this Spark headlamp has really got me turned on to headlamps. I've done some research, and I looked up some of the bigger brand name of headlights, Black Diamond and so forth. And what I found, they're pretty expensive. But this little guy right here, two for $13.99. And I'll tell you what, the functions and capability and durability of this is very comparable to those higher price headlamps that you'll find out there. It is plastic, okay? It's not metal, but it's indestructible. Well, I don't like to use that word even though they do. It's drop resistant, supposedly, up to 10 feet. We're gonna test that out now. All right, so here we go. This is a drop test. I'm holding it up as high as I can. Oh, let me turn it on first. And I'll put it on blinking again because it's easier for you to see that it's working that way. I'm holding it up as high as I can and dropping it. It still works. I'm holding it up as high as I can. I'm dropping it. It still works. I'm going to toss it up in the air and drop it. It still works. Let's drop it on something harder, shall we? All right, I'm going to drop it onto this stump here. Ow, I don't like that sound. But it's still working. Let's do it again. It dropped off of the log onto the ground. But look, it's still working. Let's do it one more time. There you go, guys. It's still working. Still works that way too. Not a crack, not a scratch, not a dent. So do I feel confident that if I were to accidentally drop this somewhere on the trail or at camp, that it's still gonna work? Do I feel confident? Absolutely. All right, welcome back. As you can see, the drop test had no effect on it. And uh, you know, that's realistic dropping, okay? I'm not gonna be throwing this thing up in the air. 
I'm not going to be beating it up against a tree or slamming it onto the ground. But if I did drop it 10 feet or so, I can rest assured that it's still going to function. And that's great. Now let's talk about water resistance. Okay? They give this a water resistance level of IPX5. And all that information is right here on the box. Okay, so your water resistant level IPX5. Alright, what that means, I had to Google it, and I did. What that means is that it is resistant to water at a low stream from any angle. So, let's test that out right now, shall we? Alright, so here we have the Von Spark headlamp. You can, hopefully you can tell that it's on. It's daylight outside, so it's hard to tell. Let me do this. Let me uh, put it on flashing mode. That way it'll be easier for you to tell that it's on. We're going to simulate with the water hose some light rain. I have it set on mist. So we're going to mist, we're going to hose this thing down. And it says from all angles. So let's get it from the back side, the sides, the top, the front. You can see it is still working just fine. Alright, that's on mist. Let's flip this thing over to shower. Which would simulate a very heavy torrential downpour of rain. This is a constant stream. And again, from every angle, you can see that it is still working just fine. Let's see what else we can do. Heavier rain. It's still working, guys. So I'm, I feel confident that if I was stuck in a torrential downpour with this on my head, it's still going to function. No problem. All right, welcome back. As you can see, the water resistant IPX5 is accurate. Heck, I feel confident that if I was in my kayak and capsized, this would survive better than I would. If I've got a trach, that would be disastrous for me. But water resistancy, durability, so far, great. Let's talk about the functions of this headlamp, okay? First of all, the strap. It's made of a very stretchy, very strong and resilient, I'm not sure exactly what the material is, but it is stretchy, and as you can see, it is adjustable. So, I don't have a large head, so I had to adjust it down quite a bit. And I still have room to do that more. So I think even a small one, a child, you could adjust this down to fit. But it's very comfortable on because it's very lightweight. All right, how much does it weigh, you're asking? Is it lightweight? Yes, it's very lightweight. Let's get our scale out here. I've got it set on ounces. See if I can get this to balance on here. And show you guys 4.0 ounces is the weight so man this thing is very lightweight and since it's on your head that gives your hands freedom to do the things that it they need to do all right the light itself is 200 lumens okay and I'll tell you what this thing lights up an area like you wouldn't believe even on low setting Speaking of settings, let's talk about that. This Spark headlamp has seven settings. I'm going to go through them now for you, okay? Right now it's off. And in the daylight, it's going to be kind of hard to tell. But, as a matter of fact, let's go to a little bit darker area, shall we? Alright, so here we are in the man cave. It's a little bit darker. Um, the windows are open, so it's not completely dark, but it will help me to demonstrate the seven modes that this light has. The button is right on the top. It's very easy to find. You don't have to feel around with two hands. Your hand will go right to it in the middle. Bright. Medium. High. 
glassing. And then after that, if you turn it on and then you hold it for three seconds, you'll see it goes to red. And then with red, uh, you click again and you get SOS. After the SOS, you have blinking. All right, so there you go. Now to, 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 uh, to go back, when you're on red to go back to white, you just hold the light, the hold the button for three seconds and then you're back on white. If you want to go back to red, you hold the button for three seconds you go back to red. I don't know exactly how long, but once the light has been on for a while and you want to turn it off, you just have to push the button once and it turns off. You don't have to go through all of the series to make it turn off, which is great. And then it has a memory, okay? So when you turn it back on, right? For example, I just turned it off on single red, all right? So now when I turn it back on, it's going to come back on in single red. And then if I uh, want to get it back to the white again, I hold it for three seconds and now it's on white. And I hope I'm not blinding you too bad. But I wanted to demonstrate it so you can see all of the functions. All right, so now I'm going to turn it off. Just one click to turn off. Don't have to go through all the cycles again. It's going to remember the last time I had it on that it was on low white. So when I turn it back on, it's back on low white. Pretty awesome. And I'll tell you what, it puts out a good beam of light. All right, so we're back outside now, but I just wanted to take you to a dark area so you could see the seven functions, okay? All right, so as you can see, the Von Spark headlight has got a lot of functions. The one thing I haven't shown you yet is this. When the light is on, you hear those clicks? You got four different clicks. That's four different degrees up to 45 degree angle that this light will shine down. So the light is not always straight ahead of you. If you want to look down, you're doing something with your hands and you need to look down instead of having to bend your head down like that, reach up and flip it down like that. And it stays very securely in all of those modes. I'll try to get an angle from the side. I don't have a cameraman, so let's see how this works. So you can have the light straight ahead, or you can move it one, two, three, four, all the way down so that the light is pointing down this way. So, overall, am I sold on headlamps now? Absolutely. Is there a reason to spend sixty, seventy, a hundred dollars for a headlamp? No. This thing does everything the others do and it holds up as well as the others do. On top of that, Vaunt offers a lifetime warranty on this headlamp. Lifetime. And believe me, they're dedicated to helping you out and making sure that you're satisfied with their product. If something happens to this, they're gonna take care of you. All you have to do when you get your box, there'll be a little card and it'll have a website for you to go to. And on that website there, that's where you go and it's very simple to do. Just register the product and you've got a lifetime warranty. Never heard of the company until they contacted me. I was hesitant at first, but now that I've got it, I'm going to be buying more of their products. Speaking of buying more of their products, don't forget the promo code. Again, it's right here. And it's down in the description section. You can get 10% off, all right? But hey, that's not the best part. Since they sent me two, and I only need one, I'm gonna give away one to one of you lucky viewers. All you have to do is one, be subscribed to my channel. Two, leave a comment saying I'm in. And three, you have to live in the continental United States for me to afford the shipping and handling. So, if you're interested in winning one of these, you know what to do. Subscribe, comment, and then I will have a drawing. When will I do the drawing? Ah, I've got a lot coming up. 
I'm going to do the drawing in one week, okay? So one week from today, that is July the 28th. That's Tuesday, July 28th. I remember that because it's my game night. Before I have game night, I'm going to go in, I'm going to do the random generator and pick a winner to win this second untouched, unopened Font Spark headlamp. Well, that's what I got for you guys today. I hope that you realize that this light is durable, water resistant, easy to operate, lots of functions, adjustable. What more could you ask for? And right now, this is listed as the number one best seller in the headlamp category on Amazon. Well, that's what I got for you guys today. I appreciate you coming along on Urban Outdoors. And until next time, keep calm, carry on, and keep it outdoors. probably do is turn my hat around this way and then put it on like that.